Former Ivorian Prime Minister Guillaume Sogo has broken his silence on the conditions set by certain influential members of the government on his return to Ivory Coast after four years in exile. Almost a month after his telephone conversation with President Alassane Ouattara, negotiations to facilitate his return to the country have been still. Guillaume Sogo, former president of the Ivorian National Assembly, who has openly expressed his desire to end his exile, attributes this statement to conditions imposed by certain ruling party members. These conditions include his membership to the ruling party of President Alassane Ouattara. According to the party, Guillaume Soro must declare his return, show his sincerity, and be sanctioned. In his view, these demands show a lack of commitment to peace and reconciliation on the part of certain members of the ruling party. But he asserts that these obstacles will not diminish his determination or his patience. The telephone conversation between Guillaume Soro and President Alassane Ouattara had raised hopes of a reconciliation between the two men facilitating the return of the president of Génération et Peuple Solidaire of Ivory Coast. In a short statement published on social network on April 4th, he welcomed the beginning of political reconciliation in Ivory Coast. <laughs>